Hello, it's me, Mr. Gilliard. So, right now, I'm going to walk you through the process of how to set up a smart music account online using the web browser you have right now. That way, when you come in for class, you are able to simply go to the instrument room, log on to the smart music account there, which is a practice room subscription, and immediately start taking your test. Easy process, real simple. Follow along with the video, take you about uh, five minutes, max, if you type quick. The first thing that you need is an email address. You must have an email address in order to sign up for Smart Music. I recommend using Yahoo, real easy, make an email address for yourself, and with creating a new account down here, and you'll be all set. If you already have an email address, you don't have to worry about this step. All right. Your next step is you're going to go to gradebook.smartmusic.com. See, it popped up immediately for me. Gradebook.smartmusic.com. Normally, Smart Music doesn't have this available from the front of their website. Whenever you're connected to the Internet and you're using Smart Music, this is the site that it logs into because everything's saved on their servers. So, gradebook.smartmusic.com. As you get there, in the upper right-hand corner... You can see the words log in here. You're going to click on this. After you click on log in, you're going to click on create a new account. Now, if you already have an account, duh, just log in, existing customer. Create new account. Now, what it's going to ask for is your birth month. Let's say I was born in October 1990. Your birth month and your birth year. And our email address. Right now, I'm just going to make up one real quick. Uh, Mr. Student at MrGilliardMusic.com. And it's going to ask you to confirm your email address. So make sure you type it correctly. Password. Must be at least six characters. After you do your password, you have to create a username username or an email address. If you don't have a username you can really think of, I think I'm going to go with Mr. Student 1914 There we go. And I'm going to confirm my username by typing it twice. <coughs> Country, United States is right at the top. Click it. Unclick. Yes, keep me informed of Make Music Products, blah 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 via email. Hit continue. Step two. Everything here with a required star and the word required next to it you must fill in so my first name is mister my last name is student skip organization you don't really need it address I'm gonna use the school address for right now 5401 Barker Place and that's Lanham Maryland zip code is 20706 and the phone is 30191 whoops 918 8680 Hit save. And it's going to ask you now, are you a teacher? Are you a student? Are you enthusiast or professional? I am a student. Well, Mr. Student. So I'm going to click student. Pay very close attention to this next page because you have to select your grade your ensemble, how long you've been playing music, and what your instrument is, for whatever reason. Um, nah, for now, let's say seventh grade. I got held back a lot. <laughs> All right, grade seven, Mr. Student, Mr. Student 1914. Uh, choose file. This is if you want to put a picture or an icon of yourself up there. If you do, cool. If you don't, don't worry about it. You can do it here at home on your web browser. All right, my school. Your school is Thomas Johnson Middle School, Lanham. Please make sure you select this one. Why? Thomas Johnson Middle School, Lanham. Please make sure you select that one. Okay. What I play. Choose one or more ensembles. You're in band? You're in band. Good. I play 
I play saxophone. But, no, for today I'm going to play clarinet. I play clarinet, and years I've been playing, uh, beginner, one year, two, three, four, five years or more. I've been playing for three years. Save changes. Alright. The next thing you need to do is click on Enroll. Now, whatever mod you're in, mod 3A, 4A, 5A, or 6, you need to make sure you click on Enroll. Only one other person in here needs to click on Percussion Students. If you show up in the Percussion Students class, I'll automatically remove you. Don't do it. So, for right now, Mr. Student is going to enroll in Mod 3A, because that's his class. Or rather, it's my class. <laughs> and I'm done. Taking a look at your screen right here, you'll see our book, Foundations for Superior Performances, here. Um, we don't have any submitted assignments. We don't have any practice reports. We don't have any pending assignments for Mod 3A. If there was a pending assignment, you'd see it here, and you'd even see the due date that it, you'd even see the due date for it. That's going to show up in the next video that I upload. And that's pretty much it. That's you setting up your Smart Music account here online. After you're done, log out. In case you forget your password, and I highly suggest you write your password down, you can click on Forgot Password, and it will be mailed to you. It'll say enter a username or an email address, and then click Reset Password. It'll email you a temporary password, and you'll be able to get back in. Do not ask me to do it. I don't have access to your email address or your password or anything like that. Got it? Good. All right. Happy practicing. Happy testing. And let's have a great year.